Why did we do it, right? So, um... That's a hundred dollar question. It's <laughs> a million dollar question. I know what it started out as, and I can tell you why it continues to go. Um, it started out with just an idea. I've always wanted to have a restaurant. In my mind, this is the perfect spot for what I want to do in, in opening a restaurant one day. And that's really how it started with the company store. Um, I think two weeks after we put it under contract, Joe Klein came out here and had my mom in tears. Um, because when we told them, because we never had intentions of, of tearing these down. We always had intentions of saving them. We just didn't know what we were going to do with them. We just figured they would be here for show. And when we told him that, he was just happy that no one was going to be bulldozing it and, and gave my mom a hug, and they were both in tears, and my mom is not one to be in tears. So <laughs> that's not her personality. And so, you know, that's when we started to, that's probably the first point I can remember where this started to become bigger than what we started. And then we closed on October 6th, and October 7th we had a volunteer day, and Bill came out here that day. And Carolyn and Anita was out here, and Joe was out here, and everybody was out here excited about what we were doing and wanting to be a part of it. And that's really what it's turned into. It's not about the restaurant, it's not about the hotel, it's not about the reservoir, it's not about... I mean, yeah, those are all great things, and yes, it'll create jobs, and it'll bring a lot of money and attention to our area, but it's about the people feeling a sense of hope and believing in something. No stopping. And, and I feel that way about what we're doing. I mean, I feel that it's extremely important uh, for our area, and of course, there's a lot of social issues that are extremely important, but from an economic standpoint, it, it's just... I mean, we have something we can be proud of, something we can make, some, an experience we can share with people and why we love this place so much. In North Carolina, I chose to live here. And, and you know, for good and bad, there's a lot of things you love about North Carolina and there's a lot of <laughs> things that are very different about North Carolina. It, has, it serves a bigger purpose. I see this being a destination where it will help grow areas like Morganton and like Hickory because people want to come here. And all the culture and the history and where people want to come here and spend the day, spend the weekend, have things to do basically live, we say live like a mill villager, but even live like a North Carolinian for a day. Yeah. <laughs> People love the South. As much as they make fun of it, they love the South. I think it's important that we have a place that highlights all the, the richness we have. And that's Henry River. <laughs>